Am I ready for bed? Hello and welcome to Wildflowers. It is a Tuesday and... Hello, honey. It's not my forte, but could I help around the farm? We're a team and I want to do what I can to support you. There isn't really... I appreciate the offer, but working the farm helps clear my head. Books yeah. do the same for me. Do what feels right, sweetheart. There isn't really all that much for you to do. All that much that you can do. I never get tired of salmon. <laughs> because I don't think Wesley can go around feeding the animals their favorite foods. Oops. That's the correct button. Things I want, but don't yet have. Get off the ground and in my bag. All right. So now we have that for a few days. And um, we'll see about getting us some heather. Um, for the uh, time when we need to cast it again. Or maybe we want to cast another not-so-long-lasting one just in order to um, make it so that we then recast both spells on the same day once again. Yeah, I think that makes sense. So when this one wears out, or <laughs> wears off rather, We'll just cast another not so long lasting one. There we go. Finally targeted the right one. So I guess we are going to need to keep both the ordinary and the magical versions of these animals because um, one version gives the ordinary animal product which is needed sometimes and then the other version gives the magical product which is also needed sometimes But do we want to... Yeah, your favorite is spinach. Do we want to keep two of each or... Now that we need to keep um, way more different kinds of animals, do we want to just keep one of each kind? Hmm... Oh yeah, you, we are already at full hearts with, so it's just the alpacas who are actually fully grown now. Nice. Okay. Figure it out to your favorite. So I guess we have everyone but Polly figured out now as to um, what their favorite foods are. Oh, and Polly was um, grown up as well. So... Just in time. The uh, new 
baby cow that'll be born tomorrow is then going to be our only baby animal for a while. Cleocatra. Still loving that, aren't ya? Alright, let's go see what new Violet has for us. Oh, and Iron Ingots. You know when it's nice to have a roaring hot forge in your workplace? Winter. Yeah, I bet. <laughs> I wonder if that's enough iron ingots. I think the, um, the second greenhouse was quite demanding in terms of iron ingots. Uh, let's keep the copper ingots as well, just in case. Violet? Ugh, Sebastian always wants the latest electronic doodad for a present. But Dad doesn't send enough money home for that. Aww. Okay, so we've got these two and 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 ten more. Okay. So we'll buy these and um, then see if we can unlock a few more. Let's sell this. Six new designs. Okay. Hmm. I like this one. Many of these are a bit too neon. Well, this one's nice. Yeah. A bit too uh, neon glowy for my tastes. But, um... We'll see if we can make some of those. Hey, that's the snowman that the children built. Nice. And, um, Sebastian? My mom caught me drinking a cup of coffee and freaked. I don't think it's sunk in how much Violet and I have grown up. Hmm, yeah, must be difficult for your mom. I'm not gonna say no to a surprise snack. Oh, that's a full heart. Nice. Hello, Kai. This stall couldn't be in a better location. Let's get some avocados, pineapple, and some leather. And, um, Thomas? We haven't talked to Thomas in a while. Are you out here? Yes, you are. Hate to say it, but Kim's a great organizer. They go out of their way to make sure there's dishes I can eat at the winter feast. Yeah. Not making anything for it this year, I see. 
Or at least, um, you don't need my help to make anything for it this year. Marty? It's no fair that even though Glory is technically uh -huh. newer to this one again? Us, she loopholed right through the newbie treatment. And I think I saw some Heather over here, actually. Yeah, lovely. I guess we could go see what we need for the uh, new outfits. Oops. Actually, Parker almost forgot. I love working in my garden and the feeling of soil in my hands. Some people. Ah, uh, yeah, we need eight more iron ingots. Hmm. I guess we could go mining for iron ourselves, too, one of these days. You know, when we're not too busy. Gloria? It's good to have a life that keeps me busy. I don't want to continue dwelling on the past. Eight more iron ingots is sixteen more iron. I do want to get the building of that last building project underway. Now, let's see about this. Oh, the magical clothes are in a category of their own. Yeah, a bit too neon glowy for me. But I like the this jacket. Purple leather, black leather, black cloth. And glimmer coating. And I also like the perfect glitch overalls. But let's make the heliotrope jacket thing first. We need to make some purple dye. And let's also see what we need for the glimmer coating. There it is. Oh, rainbow milk and pig feather. Well, I guess golden egg and pig feather for the sparkle coating. So, um, we already have a magical duck, like, on the way. Um, the, um, we'll be able to hatch that egg in, well, I guess just in a couple of days. So, I guess the next animal baby, after the, uh, cow baby is born, the next animal baby we'll want to have is probably going to be the, um, pig, then. A magical little piggy that will eventually um, give us pig feathers. Interesting. Let's go and see if we can find any of that mistletoe today. Well, I guess the, uh, the overalls just required rainbow cloth, which is made out of rainbow wool, which I think, well, actually, 
we'll um, we'll have to see whether it's the magical sheep or the magical alpaca that produces the rainbow wool. I think it's probably the sheep though, and then the alpaca is going to produce the uh, the golden wool. So I guess if we wanted to make the overalls first, then then we could um get one of our sheep pregnant next. But I think I do want the jacket first. So yeah, we'll um we'll have a little magical piggy. Um after we've had the uh hopefully magical um baby cow. And I guess the sheep is going to be next after the pig and uh, then the last one is going to be the alpaca. I don't really have much else left to do in the game, I don't think. Um, well, other than the uh, winter feast and winter solstice stuff. But then after that, it's just going to be getting the magical versions of the farm animals and and making some of those magical outfits. So I don't know if I'm going to be making very many of them. Yeah, I think the uh, rainbow wool is produced by the sheep. And then the uh, golden wool is probably produced by the uh, alpaca, the uh, magical version. I don't want to, once again, drag the... Uh, showing of um of the content in this update i don't want to drag it out for too long so we'll probably just make a couple of those magical outfits and um raise one of each of the uh, magical farm animals and then we'll um, call it good on this update. Just because I don't want to make episodes that will bore you too much. I, I don't want to drag this out so that you'll get bored of uh, watching these videos. So yeah, um, we probably will continue... Uh, the gameplay here beyond the winter feast and winter solstice celebrations because I do want to raise one of each magical farm animal and then um, make a couple of the magical outfits. But um, as I said, I will try to not drag this out so much that you'll get bored with it or so much that I'll get bored with it. Um, anyway, for now, thank you so much for spending time with me here on The Mellow. It was lovely to have you. Please remember to be kind to yourself. Have a lovely rest of your day. And I'll see you next time.